Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Terrell. I just want to show you how you can format something based on the specific text that is within the cell. So here we have a range of dates, sales on the given day, and if the sales are greater than 640 for the day, it's considered good, and if it's less than 640, then it's considered bad. But let's just say we wanted to highlight all of the area, all of the cells that have the word good in green, and we wanted to automatically highlight all the cells um, with word bad in red. So to do this, first we want to highlight the range that we want to apply the conditional formatting to, which is going to be all of the text. Then we want to go to the Home tab, and then towards the middle right, you can see a section called Styles, where we can click on Conditional Formatting. After we click on Conditional Formatting, go towards the bottom and click New Rule. Where here we can see the full breadth of all the options that are available to us when it comes to conditional formatting. And we're going to click on the second one from the top. It says Format Only Cells That Contain. Because we want to format only cells that contain a specific text. And then from here, we're going to say Edit the Rule Description. We're going to edit the specific rules where we're going to. Um, Edit a specific rule. So we're going to click format only cells that cells with not so value but specific text. And here you, you can say containing, not containing, getting with with or ending with. Um, I'm just going to say containing because we want to use the whole word, but kind of show you the different things you can base it on. And then we're going to click just type in good. And then format text. We're going to click on fill, click on green because we want to um, format the text and have a the font that so be green. Also, we're going to want to um, change the color of the font too. Let's say we wanted the font to be a um, dark green and bold. Click OK. And we can see this is kind of what the it would look like. So you can click on format to adjust the formatting of the text or cells. Um, this is, and it gives you kind of preview of what, what it's going to look like. Okay. And now all of the cells with the word green, with the word good, is um, has a green highlight and has bold green letters. So now to the similar thing, but for the word bad. So I'll highlight the range again. Go to home. Go to conditional formatting, um, go to new rules, format only cells that contain, and then we're going to say specific text, containing bad, and then no format, and then we're going to go click on format to adjust the format. We want to change the fill the cell to red, let's just say you wanted a little bit of lighter red, we can click on more colors. Um, custom, and then just a little bit of lighter red to make it look more look like what we want. So I just personally prefer deep um, lighter highlighting when you have because it, may, it helps the text stand out a bit better. I just want to do bold text with a like, dark red color. Click OK. This is kind of what that's going to look like. It might be a bit hard to read, but it works for this example. And here you have it. Cells that, cells that um, contain bad are red and green uh, for good. Let's just say we adjust the formula. So instead of 640, we were like, no, 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 it needs to be like, I don't know, um, 740. And then, as you can see, if we change, change the formula, drag it down, um, the, the formatting changes with it. Just say you were feeling nice and you wanted 620 instead, not 620, 40, just 620. As you can see, the for the formatting changes with it, with the formula in what's in the cell. So, hope you found this tutorial to be helpful. If you did, like, subscribe, comment. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.